Welcome to the BLI 1210 Citation Guide. In this video, we are going to be reviewing citation formulas so you can properly cite your research in your research worksheet. To view citation examples, refer to the APA Citation Samples tab on your research worksheet. These example citations are a form of the APA style modified for the requirements of Cox instructors. Citations can be difficult, but if we view the citation as a formula, we can simplify the citation process. In this video, we are going to look at a website citation. A website citation will follow this formula. The corporation, group, or organization's full name, the year the website was last updated or published, the title of the website, the tab or section the information was retrieved from, and then the retrieved from URL. If we follow this formula, a resulting citation for American Airlines looks like this. Next, let's create a website citation ourselves. I will use PepsiCo Inc. as our example company. Following our formula, we will put the full name of our company in the first section. Next, we will find the date of publication. For PepsiCo, this page has been updated in 2023, so I will plug that information into the first set of parentheses. Then we need to find our website title. Finding the title of your company's website can be confusing, but in practice, this tends to be the common name of your company. For PepsiCo Inc., the title of the website is just PepsiCo. In the brackets, we will put the name of the tab or section the information was retrieved from. In the case of PepsiCo, that will be Mission and Vision. And lastly, we will put the URL where we retrieved this information. This will complete our company website citation, and we can now input it into our research worksheet. As you have learned in this video, citations can be simple if we know our citation formula, but if you run into any citation issues or have any questions, your business librarians are just a click away. Just look for the Need More Help section on your course guide. Thank you for watching.